Hey guys, this is Austin from GuideMyJailbreak.com. Today I'm going to show you how to install and use an app called Lock Info. Go ahead and tap Cydia. Tap Search. Type in Lock Info. One word. Before you purchase this app, you have 14 days to try it out. So go ahead and tap Install. Tap Confirm. Tap Restart Springboard. It's basically just a quicker way to restart your device. When your iPad restarts, you should see this screen. You're going to see some new notifications on it. You might need to activate it, so I'll show you how to do that. Slide to unlock. Come over to Settings app. Press Settings. Scroll down. Tap Lock Info. Okay, so if it wasn't activated already, that should have activated it. So go back to the lock screen by turning it off. Turn it back on. So you should see Mail and Calendar. Lock info is awesome because you can see your most recent unopened mail and you can actually go to the mail from the lock screen really quickly. Done. Goes back to the lock screen. You actually can open up the mail app straight from lock info by pressing that button. It sends you to the mail app. You also can see your calendar. To see a calendar event, just tap on it. It's done. The great thing about lock info is you can personalize what you see on this lock screen. So to personalize that, go ahead and slide to unlock. Tap the settings app. Tap plugins. So with the iPad, you can use calendar, mail, and notifications. Favorites and phone and SMS are just for the lock info version of the iPhone. So for the calendar, that's already going to be enabled. You can customize that. Change the time interval. How many events are shown. Whatever you want. Same thing for mail. You can choose the max amount of messages. You can choose whether you want to show the sender image, show the account name, show the subject. Basically, you can customize the whole thing. Notifications is basically just going to show you notifications from apps that you have downloaded. I don't like it, so I keep that disabled. The great thing about lock info is you can download other plugins. You can get the weather. RSS feed, to-do list, all these will allow you to use your iPad quicker and more efficiently. I'm just going to download the Twitter because I love Twitter. It's going to send you to the Cydia page. Just tap install and confirm. For some of the new plugins, you might have to restart your device before it works. This one, you just have to return to Cydia. Turn it off. Turn it back on. Basically what that allows me to do is compose a Twitter message straight from my lock screen. For this to work, you have to have your Twitter account already enabled. Send it and compose a Twitter message. Simple as that. I hope you enjoyed this video. To see more, go ahead and check out GuideMyJailbreak.com. Thanks for watching.